Just last year, a mystery buyer purchased the mansion in Mulholland Estates for a whopping $10.8 million, and now records have revealed the new owner is none other than Chris Comstock, who's known to his millions of fans as Marshmallow. The world famous DJ bought his lavish Los Angeles starter home only three years ago for $3.6 million, located in the Hollywood Hills, but as his success continues to grow, he's upgrading his real estate along the way too. Today we'll check out Marshmallow's current Mulholland Estates property as well as where he used to live, we even found the listings. In these videos, we don't reveal any addresses, and even though I've done a house tour of my own place, please do not show up at any private residences because it's not safe for anyone. Marshmallow is an electronic music producer and DJ who rose to fame in early 2015 by publishing his remixes online, and his first studio album was released a year later. The Pennsylvania native kept his identity a secret initially, but in 2017 was confirmed by Forbes to be Chris Comstock. He wears a custom white helmet that looks like a marshmallow for performances and his music videos, and it's been a party for the DJ since his debut in 2015. Chris AK Marshmallow established himself as one of the top electronic music acts overnight it seemed, and his songs like Silence, Wolves, Happier and more have been named certified multi-platinum across the globe. Behind Marshmallow's successful records and his mystery persona, he also has a dream team working for him, including his star manager Mo Shalizi, who's often given credit for quickly creating the Marshmallow brand. Not to mention, the DJ also had early shoutouts from other big names in the industry like Tiesto and Skrillex. Either way, Marshmallow's earnings in 2019 alone ranked him second on the list of highest paid DJs, and these days his estimated net worth is at $40 million. Hey guys, it's Kara the Vampire Slayer and I'm bringing you another house tour here on Famous Entertainment. I noticed a bunch of you guys watching our videos aren't subscribed, so be sure to hit that subscribe button and ring that bell and help us get to 1 million subscribers. It's just been revealed that a mystery buyer of a $10 million mansion in Mulholland Estates is none other than world famous DJ Marshmallow, so we're gonna check out his current home. It's only been a short few years since he bought his starter LA house for $3.6 million in Hollywood's Laurel Canyon neighborhood, so we'll look at that place too. I mean, the dude earned an estimated $56 million in one year alone and shows no sign of slowing down, so a mansion upgrade was definitely in the cards for him. As always, don't forget to follow me on Instagram to chat and now let's get into this video. Not long after Marshmallow quickly made it big in Hollywood, in 2018 he was able to buy himself a starter home located in Laurel Canyon, just above West Hollywood and at the east end of the Sunset Strip in Los Angeles. The guy was clearly winning at life since the sleek home cost him $3.5 million and came secure with loads of privacy thanks to walls and gates around the entire property. Not to mention there was a full security system with a ton of cameras. The home was custom built in 2014 in a contemporary style with 5,200 square feet of space designed with only the best craftsmanship and a short bamboo lined wooden stairway with large waterfall leads to the Japanese inspired front door. While the square footage inside is spacious and pretty generous for this neighborhood, the yard isn't too large as the home sits on a quarter parcel of land. Regardless, the backyard is intimate and cozy as well as private with a terrace for outdoor dining and a large fire pit. There was even room for a perfect pool and spa with waterfall, so it's really all you need. There are wide plank hardwood floors throughout Marshmallow's former residence, and they line the entryway, which boasts an architectural floating staircase above an indoor pond of some sort. Then to one side of the entrance, there's an eye-catching double-sided glass fireplace, which divides the formal living and dining room, and the dining room boasts a classy stone wall. The kitchen is modern and functional with a Caesar Stone Center Island and high-class appliances, and also on this level, there's a gift or staff suite and family room. The family room has a see-through fireplace and TV, and this space overlooks the backyard. Moving upstairs, it seems there's a sprawling landing that's been turned into a sitting space, and there are four more bedrooms on the upper level, all of which are ensuite. That central lounge space at the top of the stairs also has some skylights overhead. Marshmallow's former master suite boasted a ton of features like a fireplace, a private balcony, and luxury bathroom. The ensuite had a large glass shower front and center, as well as some other spa-like features.
features. The contemporary residence was also full of smart home technology to make for a comfortable daily lifestyle. Either way, this was quite the impressive starter home for a DJ like Marshmallow who was quickly rising to the top and his latest real estate investment, while well, this proves his success even more. Now let's take a look at Marshmallow's recent upgrade. While he reportedly purchased the mansion last summer, the buyer's identity remained a secret and only now do we know it was the mysterious DJ himself. Located in the guard-gated and exclusive community of Mulholland Estates in the mountains above Sherman Oaks, Los Angeles, you'll find the large house Marshmallow dropped a whopping $10.8 million on. Here his neighbors include the likes of Kendall Jenner, Christina Aguilera, Paris Hilton and more. His new party pad sits on a lot spanning over half an acre and was built back in 1992 by the celebrity loved architect Richard Landry who built the home stylish and modern. The interiors were done by Jeff Lewis. Marshmallow's house is super white and looks like it belongs in Miami. Although the home isn't gated, the community is 24-7 guard gated with the security often on patrol and a ton of cameras so it's unlikely you'll be able to access this property without living there. Glass front doors welcome you to Marshmallow's mansion where there's a double height foyer, marble floors and 7,818 square feet of space. There are five beds and seven baths throughout and there's a formal living room beside the entryway with a fireplace and on the other side, a dining room with double chandeliers. His new eating kitchen has not one but two islands, one which is set up for casual meals and all the lavish appliances you could want. Elsewhere in the mansion, there's a library and office as well as a family room that opens through glass doors to the large back terrace. On the upper level of the massive home, there are four ensuite bedrooms along with the fancy master retreat. Marshmallow's bedroom is like its own little private apartment considering it has dual walk-in closets, a TV lounge area, a walkout terrace, and even a kitchenette. Then his spa style attached bath boasts high ceilings, a glass shower, and separate tub underneath the chandelier. The winding staircase through the home has a gorgeous wall of windows alongside it and there's even another secret level downstairs. The finished basement floor of Marshmallow's mansion has another lounge and entertainment center perfect for casual hangouts and a fancy web bar. My personal favorite part of the property might just be the outdoor area where the hillside lot is steep but also offers amazing views overlooking the hills and deep into the San Fernando Valley. There's also plenty of space for Marshmallow to entertain friends and family back here or even put on a private DJ performance. The yard boasts nice terraces all over, some built for outdoor dining and of course there's a beautiful swimming pool and spa. Alright so now we've checked out the homes of world famous DJ Marshmallow or Chris Comstock, including his new $10.8 million Mulholland Estates mansion. After checking out his contemporary starter home and his bigger, better upgrade, what did you guys think? Which would you rather live in? I like both of them, but I would probably pick the current mansion because of the amazing backyard and pool, as well as the finished basement level and the master suite. I know it has a lot of white inside and out, it's almost blinding, but I think it looks classy. Be sure to let me know your thoughts or rate Marshmallow's homes down in the comments. Thanks for tuning in. As always, don't forget to follow me on Instagram to chat, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye!